spy who has infiltrated the Cavs and trying to sabotage them. Confirmed. Hey guys, it's Ty. Thanks for watching The Fumble. For all the latest news on all your favorite athletes, make sure to hit subscribe and make sure to follow me on the gram and Twitter at Taiwan on Sports. All right, you would think that on a game like Monday's between the Cavs and the Raptors where the Cavs completely swept them, it would be nothing but sunshine and rainbows and full hairlines for the Cavs, but no! There was a dark cloud that hung over them last night. In the final seven minutes of the game when the Cavs were up by 30, Ty Lu tried to sub in Rodney Hood for LeBron. According to reports, he refused to come in after his number was called, making him the only guy who didn't play in game four. Sabotage confirmed. Okay, obviously, I'm kidding. Y'all know we play too much here at the Fumble, but that is sus and not a good look. Guys, drop a comment and let me know if his ass should be suspended for that, because technically the Cavs have the right to suspend him. One Cavs player who has chosen to remain anonymous said, This is the playoffs. We're trying to win a championship. This isn't about you. He's right. LeBron, you better get your bit. <laughs> I'm kidding, but you better get him. Hood was acquired from the Jazz in February when the Cavs were on their rebuilding tour 2018, and in general, well, he's, he's had a rough series, going from one of nine from the floor and scoring two points in 39 minutes through the first three games. Mm, mm. His teammates are pissed, and they have a right to be. They're all crazed in war mode where it's a brotherhood right now, okay? You're either in or you're out. Rodney has allegedly apologized to the GM and says he feels awful. Meh. Here's the thing, he's 25, guys. He's still pretty young, even in NBA years, and they age really fast there, unless you're LeBron. Now, there are more and more players where it seems like they just aren't able to handle the pressure of intense scrutiny and need to perform. It even took LeBron a while to develop the skin as well, but here's the thing. No, wait. He actually still be out here reacting, but he doesn't allow it to affect his game in a negative way. In fact, a LeBron under pressure is a scary LeBron. So Rodney has time to recover, and I hope he does because he's about to be a restricted free agent and um, not a good time to do this. Guys, drop a comment and let me know what you think is going on with the kid. All right, as promised, today's post notification shout out goes to Dr. Nathan Thomas and Hussein Marshall. I got you guys. Guys, I am going to be in the comments commenting back on all of today's videos, so make sure you say hi and make sure you're subscribed. Much love, fam. Peace.